Mick Mulvaney couldn't lie his way out of this one. Trump Office of Management and Budget Director Mick Mulvaney tried to defend Trump's record on job creation and was confronted with a harsh dose of reality by none other than Fox News anchor Chris Wallace. On this week's edition of Fox News Sunday, Wallace told Mulvaney about a surprising statistic he'd learned this week. 3.4 million jobs have been added during the first 19 months of the Trump administration, but 3.7 million jobs were added during the last 19 months of the Obama administration, Wallace said. More jobs. So, in fact, there hasn't been a spike in jobs created under this president. Mulvaney tried, and failed to explain away those very clear numbers. Keep in mind that when you're coming back from a recession, it's actually easier to do that, Mulvaney claimed. It's easier to do what President Obama had done. Mulvaney added that the Trump administration believes Obama wasn't adding enough jobs despite the fact that Obama added 300,000 more jobs than Trump did over a comparable time period. Wait a minute, sir. Wallace interrupted. The recession was in 2008. We're talking about 2015 and 16. Seven, eight years into the Obama presidency, versus the first 19 months of the Trump presidency. Mulvaney tried sticking to his excuse, but was forced to concede that Obama left Trump with a great economy. We've been able to start at a fairly high level and continue that growth level, Mulvaney said. But as Wallace had already pointed out, Job growth is actually slower under Trump than it was under President Obama. During Trump's first full year in office, average yearly job growth fell to the lowest level since 2010, when the recovery was just beginning. By contrast, Obama created almost 16 million jobs during the recovery, including those 3.7 million jobs created during the final year and a half of his presidency. And despite having the benefit of hindsight, Trump and Mulvaney are pursuing the same failed trickle-down policies that led to the recession, and then some. Mulvaney's humiliation comes in the same week that Sarah Huckabee Sanders was forced to apologize for outright lying about President Obama's record of creating jobs for black Americans. Sanders had absurdly claimed that Obama had only created 195,000 jobs for African Americans during his eight years in office when the real total was 15 times that. It's no wonder Trump and his gang make a second career out of attacking the very concept of truth. The facts are very rarely on their side. Thanks for watching. What did you think of this video? Let us know in the comments section below. You can also subscribe for more videos like these in your inbox. Now if you are seeking the latest trends in fashion, and electronics and gifts and more of the coolest things that you never knew existed at the best prices, Please feel free to visit www.atthismall.com once again that is www.atthismall.com If you are seeking the best in facial and clear skin regiments and products for women and men including an opportunity to earn residual income, please visit our partner at www.jdro.myrnf.com. All links are in the description box below. Share this video with your friends and family. Since you're watching, we have a small favor to ask. More people are viewing our videos more than ever but advertising revenues across the media are falling fast. And unlike many news organizations, we haven't put up a paywall. We want to keep our journalism as open as we can. So you can see why we need to ask for your help. Our videos and reports takes a lot of time money and hard work to produce. Our investigative reporting uncovers unethical behavior and social injustice, that helps to hold governments, companies and individuals to account. Through this we can, together, create meaningful change in the world. We do it because we believe our perspective matters, because it might well be your perspective too. For as little as one dollar, you can support us. And it only takes a minute. Thank you. Like and share this video on Facebook and Twitter if you agree. Don't forget to support this channel by clicking on the donation link down below and subscribing so you never miss any of our trending reports. What do you think about this video? Scroll down to comment below. Now if you are seeking the truth or guidance or need a prayer request or studies, please visit followyeshva.com at www.follow. Y. E. S. H. U. A. Now.com. Please note that we have changed to a new YouTube channel, the link is in the description box below. Please subscribe to the new channel, as this one will no longer have new videos and reports posted to it anymore.